Welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jocelyn and I make videos about fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. Today I have a designer bag video. And we're gonna be talking about 10 bags that I'm going to be wearing this spring 2024. I do have them here and I just realized that I have a lot of bags, but I think that all of them are worth it. <laughs> <laughs> if you're a designer bag lover like me, please don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And please leave me a comment if you are a designer bag addict. The first bag that I want to show you and I I need to wear more this 2024 because I bought it last year and maybe I wore it a couple of times. I wore it to Del Mar. I wore it to Del Mar and I wore it to another event and that's it. This is a Chanel mini flat bag with handle and it was bought directly from the Chanel store. The bag is small. It only fits your phone, your maybe wallet, uh, lipstick and your keys and that's it. And then it has this bag here at the back that probably your credit card or your ID fits here and that's it. I really like this bag, I really like the handle and it has this strap that unfortunately is not detachable. I don't know why they did that. I would like to wear this bag without the, the strap. I mean, it's heavy. But it's unfortunate that it's not detachable. Why? I don't know. But that, that's that, that. And you can wear it cross body. I'm 5'7 for your reference. So this one. Look, it's cute. It's a cute bag. Or you can wear it like this on your shoulder. You can wear it on your handle. I mean, there's different ways that you can wear this bag. It's a beautiful bag. Yeah, I need to wear it more this 2024. The next bag that for sure, for sure, I'm going to continue wearing this spring 2024 is, can you guess? Absolutely, my Kelly 28. This is my best friend. This bag goes with me everywhere. Like this is one of my favorite bags and is showing because I can see that it's warning out on the corners. <laughs> I need to be more careful, but I mean, it's a bag that I got to love and I want to wear it. So it's worth it, right? The investment. This one is the Hermes Kelly 28 on the box leather. It's vintage and I bought it probably five years ago when I finished my master's. So it was a gift from me to me to achieve that professional goal, right? So. This is it. This is one of my best investments ever because I pay almost nothing in comparison uh, on, on the prices that these bags retail right now. So especially when they're vintage and they're good condition, these bags retail for a lot of money. You know that. So very happy with this one. I bought it five years and five years ago they, they were not like, oh my gosh, like the way that they are right now. I feel that right now the market is so crazy and yeah. So this is my bag, my go-to bag. I am looking for a burgundy one, vintage of course on the 28th. The next bag that I have, I just got it a couple months ago and it's this tiny, tiny, tiny one. <laughs> is the Louboutin Speedy Mini and I bought it pre-love of course and it's so cute and I just add this strap it's a chain strap that I got from another bag from a coloration I think that bag is like $30 and I saw this strap and I was like I can put it on my Mini Speedy and I have a crossbody bag so here you go this is my beautiful Louboutin Speedy Mini and it only fits my phone and probably a lipstick and that's it. That's it. It's just for the sake of having it. This is a cutie and as I told you I got it pre-love and the price was really good. We pre-love. I contacted the guy. It was a guy. I think it was like his, his girlfriend or something. <laughs> and I uh, 
he said, oh, I'm okay, blah, blah, blah. We got the agreement and I, I uh, first authenticated and it's authentic, so deal. I know. The next bag that I have is very difficult to find right now. In fact, it's sold out everywhere. Aha. Uh -huh. And I am talking about the Demelier on the Suede material. This bag is on high demand right now and I know why. It's a classic representation of old money because it does not have logos. It does have the logo here very discreet the millier and that's it so inside it has oh i found my belt inside has a lining on fabric material and it has a strap a very functional strap so you can wear it across the body like this and i believe this is the medium version the medium size and this is it so it has the handle it has the shoulder strap very convenient it's so beautiful 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 and it's really well made so that's why it's on high demand it's a bag that is less than a thousand dollars i believe this one is six hundred dollars and i bought it on sale if you follow me on my instagram some of you took advantage of the sale mm -hmm. so that's why you need to follow me on my instagram so you are aware i can give you notice of sales and so on so this is a beautiful bag right now i have on my wish list at the white color i cannot find it like seriously i read down that it is in stock it just sells super fast but i'm happy to continue wearing this this spring despite that it's sweat that's fine the color is very versatile that it can mix and match with any type of outfit that i'm going to be wearing this spring so very happy with the Melier tote bag this is the small or medium size i don't know i'm just gonna put it here because i know that we have a large size as well that in case that you want to fit your 13 inch computer your laptop you can fit there this one no you cannot fit your laptop here it's too short here so it it, it doesn't but you can fit a lot of stuff here guys like even a sweater if you want and it's very it's so convenient and it looks so so cute look even with this dress next i have three bags of the same designer and i got all these three bags pre-love and they were a deal they were a deal the first one let me just get it is the the raw margot bag i got this bag a pre-love from my go-to seller my japanese seller from ebay they authenticate the bags for you and right now ebay is authenticating the bags before they send the bags to you so it's kind of what bestiaire collective is doing i think the seller signs up um when they're listing the items so ebay can authenticate the item so the seller sends the item to the ebay hub and then the ebay checks if the bag is authentic and only then ebay sends the product the bag to you so you have peace of mind that you're receiving an authentic item that's really good this seller i have been buying bags from like forever in fact my kelly bag is from them i bought my kelly bag from them and then i bought my chanel kelly from them as well my Chanel Kelly is vintage and that was my first Chanel bag ever. Super, super happy. So I have been buying bags from them like forever. So I saw this one on sale from them like for less than retail price when the raw Margot bag was ramping up. Right now this bag is insane. It's very difficult to get and if you find it on the pre low market, you're going to find it above the retail prices crazy it's like hermes bag is not like an hermes bag but it's getting there you get your money back so when i saw this bag that it was less than the retail price i was like i pulled the trigger and i know that it was coming from this seller so i had a peace of mind so very very happy with this bag i have been abused this bag it's a really good bag and why am i saying that i'm abusing this bag 
well, I took this bag to Paris, France this last time and I packed my bag with a bunch of things, guys. And I was carrying this on the airport and honestly, I was so tired that the last thing that you care is where's your bag or what are you doing with your bag? I put it under the seats of the plane. I put it on my feet when I was waiting at the airport. You can see an image here of all the stuff that I put inside of this bag and it looks pristine guys the quality is perfection and i see the corners of this bag i was a little bit you know uh i don't know on the fence because it's a sweat bag and i have not treated the sweat uh yet but the corners look good i am so so happy this is a really really good bag with high quality that's why this bag is on high demand right now and i get it I am looking for the brown color, of course, because the brown color is a classic right now. And I'm looking for the 17. And despite that I said before that the 17 was too big for me, I changed my mind. After my Paris trip and the way that I fitted this bag, <laughs> it's the Mary Poppins bag, right? I think that I'm gonna go ahead and pull the trigger with the Rome Margot on the 17 brown of sweat that's in my wish list and it's going to happen eventually i'm trying to see if i can find it second hand pre-love especially if this seller has it i'm just gonna jump <laughs> right away but they don't have it yet but i'm just gonna wait patiently and that's what i'm going to be doing so very happy with the roll margot bag I'm gonna go ahead with a proper review of this bag because you're gonna see that I have more. Huh. Yeah. Speaking of which, uh, the next bag that I have is the Row Margot. This is the size 10 and is on the leather material. This bag, despite that, it has a flaw. It has a flaw. It does not close all the way like this. I prefer if I can close it, that will be better, but that's okay still a good bag i have been using this a lot you know that i have my prada bag the bag that i bought second hand as well i have been wearing that bag non-stop last year 2023 that was my go-to bag if i was going to go to mouth that prada bag i i mean automatically it was coming with me <laughs> now i am taking this with me instead of the Prada. I see the Prada and I'm like, ah, oh, no, I'm taking this one. So you know what I mean, right? When you see like, okay, which bag I'm gonna be wearing today. So instead of grabbing the Prada, I'm grabbing this one. And that's a good thing. What I love about this bag is that it has a, a strap that is very convenient to have like this. So you have free hands and you can just do whatever you want. and despite that it doesn't close all the way i have a dust bag here it has this okay let me just take it off <laughs> okay it has this so you can tie it like that like this okay that's the way that you close it but you still have like a like a hole there but if you grabbing it like this that is fine i still like it uh, to be honest with you, I still like it. I like it so much that I got the tan version. I got this one. Uh, okay, let me go back. This one I bought it from the road directly from their website. And this one I got it from my Japanese email seller. I know. I saw it. I was like, oh my gosh. The seller had them make an offer option. So I was like, okay, I'm just going to go ahead and make an offer. And the seller accepted. <laughs> I know. So on top of that, on top of being reduced from retail price, it's a pre-love. I got an offer on this one. So. so that was pretty cool. I put this one because I was wearing something with navy and I just want to coordinate the color. So it's just a scarf from Amazon. But this is at the back that i recently got from the Royal margot this is the 10 so i have two 10s right now and i do have the suede that is the size of 15. that's it i think i'm gonna yeah um, that's it what well, with the only exception that, that i want a 17 on the brown suede version 
If I found it on the 15, that's fine. If I found it on the 10, that's fine as well. <laughs> I just want the brown soy, but I prefer the 15 or 17 instead of the 10. But if I find a good deal on the 10 on the soy version, I know, I need to get it. The next one that I have is inside of here and I got it from the Real Real and I keep it on the same dust bag. I know that you don't supposed to keep your bags inside of dust bags, but bear with me, okay? Bear with me. And that's my neighbor that is living. Oh, he's always noisy with his car, but this is the Chanel Medium and I bought it pretty love from the Real Real and it was really good deal, but yeah. So this bags retail for almost $10,000, which is crazy also. That's another investment piece that when I saw that it was a little bit reduced, I pulled the trigger and I got it. It's a beautiful, beautiful bag. It's the medium size and it has the golden hardware. Absolutely beautiful. I must have. It's a classic and I needed to have it. Let me show you. I'm pretty sure that you already know how these ones look. Is the double flap and I have this this um, organizer that I bought and by the way I do have a discount code from Samorga organizers that I'm just gonna leave it here is 20% off if you are a designer lover for sure you are interested on the organizers to keep your bags on shape and this is it so I have a uh, uh, bag here and then here and then the organizer here and then it has the Mona Lisa here at the back which is convenient but again you can just put cards or your money there instead of opening and closing your bag and, and that's it so this is the vintage white double flap and this is how it fits I would love that the strap be more long but that's okay that's okay, so this is it. Oof, the chain is a little bit cold. So that's a way to wear it. Another way is on your shoulder like this. And then another way is that you can wear it just as a clutch, just like this. And welcome. This is a Chanel double flap. It's a classic, I'm pretty sure that you are all aware about this bag. The next one that I have is the Celine Triumph bag. This one is a shoulder bag. I wish that it, the strap would be longer, but this is it. I bought it pre-lab as well. I bought it at the Real Real. It's a small bag that only fits your bag, your bag, your phone, your lipstick, and so on. I have difficulties opening this one. You just press here and it's supposed to open, but okay, here you go. So. Let me just show you. So it secures like this and then it has this and then boom, it just opens. So I have this bag with this foam here just to keep the, the shape of the bag. And then it has a small bag here and that's it. It fits your phone, wallet, uh, lipstick, and that's it. It's just a beautiful bag to carry your basics. And for sure, I'm going to be wearing this bag as part of my spring outfits. I do have a basket bag. This one is huge and is the Loewe basket bag. And I really use it, guys. At the beginning, I was like, it's too big. Mm -mm. It's not too big. When you go to the farmer's market or you go to the grocery store, it's very, very convenient. I always have it in my car, in the back of my car, so nobody sees it. And when I needed to use it, I just pull it and I just fill my bag with my essentials, my groceries or whatever I am buying. So it's very, very convenient. It can be worn as a fish bag as well, but I'm trying to keep it <laughs> in shape because if I take it to the beach, I know that I'm gonna have some worn up, but that's okay. I mean, I, um, I, I bought it to enjoy it. So we'll see. We'll see if I'm gonna be wearing that summer. I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna be wearing that summer. So it's a huge bag from Lo Ewe. Highly recommend this one. And I need to confess something. I just bought the the Melier basket bag, this bag. I made an order because it was not in stock. And if you're lucky to find it, buy it because 
is selling really fast. Mine is going to arrive around June. That's what they told me. <laughs> That's what the website told me. Hopefully I can receive it before because by June it's going to be uh, summer. I am hoping to enjoy that bag on spring. That's the Demelier bag. It's uh, an affordable designer basket bag. Demelier, as I told you, is one of the brands that, that is all money because it's not showing the logo. So it's very discreet, very uh, not loud. And I love that. I got the Raffia with the black leather. I think that's going to be perfect for all my old black outfits because black is one of my predominant color in my wardrobe and I'm looking forward to receive that bag. So I will have two bags. I have this one from Loewe and I will have the, the Melier basket bag and if I find a good deal on another Loewe or uh, another bag that is designer for sure I'm gonna pull the trigger because I cannot have enough uh, basket bags. Alright guys, so those were my designer bags that I'm going to continue wearing this 2024. Yeah. As always, please don't forget to stop by my blog, thealuradation.com. Follow me on my Pinterest, Let's Pin Together. So the link is going to be here. And I'm waiting for you to follow me on my Instagram, thealuradation, where I am posting stories on a daily basis if I have time. <laughs> and I'm posting good deals for you so you can take advantage of the sales. As always, thank you so much for watching. And if you have more time, and if you want to continue watching, more of my videos and you can click here or here because youtube thinks that this is a match for you and i think the same all right see you there bye bye